This video will demonstrate how to assemble your snow thrower cab. Remove the contents of the box and make sure you have all of the parts. Refer to the manual for setup instructions and the parts list. Tools you require are a half inch and 9 16 inch wrench or socket, as well as an extra person to help hold the cab for positioning. Slide each set of bars labeled A and B together. Use a set screw to secure the bars finger tight. Attach bar J into the B end of the assemblies of A and B with the nut facing the inside of the frame. Insert poles F and insert into each end of bar J so the narrow end is facing up. Insert poles G and insert into the ends of the A and B assembly so the narrow end is facing up. Use a set screw to secure the bars finger tight. Assemble the curved bars D, C, and D. The C bar should be placed in the middle. Use the arrows for alignment. Tighten using the Allen wrench. Install the curved rod assembly on top of the G poles. Use the Allen wrench to tighten up all of the set screws. Use two of the H flexible rods and insert into the inside sleeve of the open cab cover. Insert both H rods into the sleeves and place the steel collared ends of the H rods into poles F. While bending the flexible rods, please use eye protection. Insert the remaining two H rods over the mounted H rods. Insert rod I over the ends of the H rods by carefully bending it. Pull the cab cover up and over the flexible rod assembly. Slide the rods into the inside pocket of the cover. Take the top of the cover and pull back. Place bar A into the elastic straps of the cover. Using the hook and loop straps, fasten the cab to the assembly. Remove the J bar from the assembly. Depending on your unit, the clamp L may be horizontal or vertical. Clamp K will always be horizontal. Pre-assemble the parts M, L, and K, but do not tighten. Use a helper to determine the best location for your enclosure to be secured to your snow thrower. Hold the crossbar J to determine the best placement on the frame. Mount the pre-assembled parts M, L, and K and tighten using the provided nuts, bolts, and washers. Center the J crossbar and secure using the M clamps. Make sure the J bar uprights are level. Tighten the L and K set screws. Insert the cab assembly into the crossbar. Secure the cab to the J bar uprights with two set screws secure tightly with a wrench. Hold the cab assembly horizontal to the ground and tighten all bolts and set screws. Check that all of the hook and loop straps are fastened and that no fabric is touching the engine. You can reveal your dash light by using the zipper in the front of the cab. Use the hook and loop straps to properly secure the cover. Adjust accordingly for free movement of the controls.